Hey guys. Woohoo. <clears throat> Just checking to see who else is coming on. Hey guys. Hi Melissa. Hi Monica. Hey Jessica. I got an order today. I'm super excited. Um, the biggest thing that I got. Hi Tara. The biggest thing I got, I got a new, um, a new black framed chalkboard. Check out this monster. Isn't it cool? Ah, this is the Aiden. I know. Hi, Laurel. So this is our Aiden and it's kind of distressed and it's a black frame. And, uh, this is going in my entry, like my hallway, um, to where my front door is my office and the frame matches the um, frames that I have my kids pictures. This is the 18 by 24. So I got this at the sale, the special when, um, for August when you could get the free um, $42 transfer. And I can't wait to show you what I got for free, which I'm super excited. It's the one that my sister just posted on my group the um sign yard sign i i always say it backwards it's like i want to say it's yard sign but it's sign yard i don't even anyway i'm gonna hold it up so excited there are um Okay, these are all letters. Oh gosh, I need to like separate them. So if I hold white in front, it's gonna be easier to see or behind it. Look at those cool letters. They are, um, if I had, oh I do have, if I disappear for a minute. Yeah, so these are like, this is three and a half inches tall. So there's a little space at the bottom. So it's probably like a three inch letter by like one to like one, one and a half is the thickest part. So these, so these letters are going to be awesome for signs, words, last names, a big welcome sign, you know, things like that. Anything that you want there's also like arrows, star, um, the at, some, some little stars, exclamation point, and then um, some other like just doodly things that you could use. Hi, Heather. Hi, Marissa. Hi, Karen. So all of these transfers are... Um, all these letters will make some really awesome. So let's say you're going to have movie night. Could you imagine using, making a little sign that would be just cute, decorate this way, go into your, my cinema room. I don't even have a cinema room, but I want one now that I can make a sign. Um, that's super cute. So let's look at what else I got. This is not necessarily a brand new transfer, but um, it's new for me. And you know how I do my open workshops where you come and you use my stuff and um, you just pay a little fee and then I feed you and I give you drinks? Well, um, somebody asked for this B um, one and I thought, how cute. And I know it's backwards, but it says, be happy, humble and kind. So you can say, be happy, be humble and kind, hive rules and queen B. I mean, who else? um you know is queen bee so we've got that and the this cute design which you could kind of add to anything i am definitely going to do a live project check out this board that i'm going to do can you see it this is another one of my mom's painted canvases i went to hobby lobby and there canvases that they sell that are like already decorated well I saw some and I saw one just like this 
and it was like $90 for a two pack and they were coordinating and you can like hang them on your wall. And I was like, $90? No. So I asked my mom, I bought this and I um, had my mom paint it in like that color scheme and it turned out beautiful and I'm going to make a welcome sign. Um, this actually will go in my home, my living room. Hi guys. Hi Roberta. Hi Sarah. Hi, Lu oh, I said hi, Laurel. Uh, and then look what I got. My witch's hat. Woohoo. Um, I haven't had this one yet, so I'm super excited. I think if I get this Halloween, this board decorated for Halloween, um, it will go up in my entryway, which is, um, we always kind of do this fun, um, tradition for Halloween where our friends who kind of live out in the country come over and we have a big neighborhood. And so they're like, I don't know, a million homes and a million kids and they come and trick or treat. So I'm excited to actually decorate for Halloween and, uh, this hat for sure. It says, I put a spell on you and it has the little, this is my favorite part. The little spider coming down. I am not afraid of spiders. Not at all. So I got this transfer and it's still up. And I know you're going to look at it and say um, it's Easter eggs. Because it is. But the reason why I got it because I love. Do you see all these hearts? Well, I love hearts. And they have these little. Um, I got to find them on here. These little strings. You can't tell that um, that's what they are. Oh, or they're hidden. But they have these little strings, and you can put the little string and drop a heart down from, like, any, just on a random, random um, board, you know, whatever you're doing, just drop a little heart, and it's super cute. I should really take it out of the package, but um, I want to get to my project. So I'm going to keep moving. I have, um, let's see, I've got like three more orders from all of our brand new transfers. Hi, mom. I'm going to, um, yeah, I know. And I never would have looked at that one because it's Easter eggs. And I'm like, I don't need Easter eggs right now. It's September. But I kept seeing people. Hi, Julie. Hi, Mary. I kept seeing people add that little heart with a string and I'm like I need the heart with the strings because that's the cutest thing you could just hang it even from a word super cute all right let's get going and do a project I'm gonna flip you over so hang on here we go here's my spade my board I need to make sure it's sturdy I got a new whoa I got a new tripod and it's really not a tripod. It's totally something um, other than a tripod. I don't know. Whatever I got is just, um, I just want to make sure it's steady. Hey, Aaron. Hi. Hi. Yeah. <laughs> he's, in, he's in the same room with me. He can um, say hi. I know. Isn't that funny? Okay. So... You guys can see that, right? It's almost all in there. Hi, Cindy. Oh my gosh. Okay. So again, I have like um, a towel. Not really. It's a sweatshirt, but I'm going to pretend it's a towel because that's way easier under here. And there is a board right here, but I just want to put something firm so that when I push down, it's going to be there. We are going to use one of the most versatile transfers we have. It's the welcome and established. So there's one that's this big, that's welcome. And then established is a skinnier word that um, comes with it. And then you cut them apart. I can show you what it looks like. Don't mind me and just rummaging through stuff because this honestly um this is one of my favorites so there are your two transfers that come together in one package hi retta hi stacy 
So let's do a welcome sign. And imagine, imagine you are creating something for a wedding and two people get married. You make them something like this. It says welcome and then like EST for established and then the year that they got married. Isn't that sweet? People would love that and it's homemade. They would cherish it forever. So we're just going to pull the transfer or pull the back off the transfer. And then um, I will get it in place. Now I'm going to ask you for some advice. I have two colors of brown and I'm not quite sure what I actually want to use. We have a dark brown, which is kind of, okay, so I have a dark brown that's kind of a reddish brown. Can you see that? And then I have more of a mocha chocolate brown. Both of those colors are kind of in here. This reddish brown is a little bit. Which one should I use? Oh, Heather, great idea. Use styrofoam block under the canvas. Great, great idea. If I had some of that around, I probably could use it. Oh, apparently my husband says we do have some of that. <laughs> so which one should I use? Should I use the dark brown or the, the lighter brown? Chime in and let me know. And then in the meantime, while I'm waiting, I am just simply going to push this down. Oh, the lighter brown, the dark brown, the dark. Ooh, look at that. I think I have, Aaron, count those up for me while I open this other thing. So with reddish brown, light brown, dark brown, lighter brown chocolate. Yeah, the dark, lighter. you think the dark brown or lighter? This is a big decision, you all know. What is reddish brown, is it lighter? What? What is reddish brown? That's the dark brown. It's a dark light dark light oh goodness and i just had an idea while i was sitting here i'm going to add hi lois it's pretty much a tie okay i'm gonna add one of those hearts on here so even if i use the um like the dark brown it's pretty much a tie are you sure we can't do a tie are you kidding me Okay. All right. Dark. 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 We're doing dark because Laurel said, come on. Are you guys still? It just dropped. Am I here? I'm here. Can you see me? Am I here? Okay. Oh. You guys, I like dropped again. Something really weird is going on with my phone and it's making me crazy. And I was hoping not to have the same thing happen that happened last night or however long ago it was. All right, I'm stirring it up, getting this brown ready to go. If you've never seen this, you want to make sure it's smooth and creamy, kind of like a yogurt or a frosting um, that you might open up, not that, so first of all, I don't bake, like, ever, so I definitely don't make homemade frosting, so I definitely open it up from a jar or a can, however, um, most people probably don't, because you guys are way better than me, okay, so, um, I'm going to, um, use my angled squeegee, again, because, uh, we've got a big space to cover, and I want to make sure I've got a good grip, and I've got um, nice broad lines with this. So I'm pulling out lots, and I'm just kind of like putting it, dabbing it around. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Mom, are you watching? Are you excited? Hi, Tammy. Hi, Shannon. Hi, Kelly. Okay, so here goes. We've got the dark brown. 
this is so easy to cover. It is seriously like, I, like my four-year-old could do it. And actually, he's only three, so that's saying something. So easy. What I love is that the transfer makes it like nearly impossible to mess it up. I have terrible handwriting. I can't, you know, I can't paint or do calligraphy or my, my words just don't um, come out very pretty. Uh, so doing something like this where it's super easy, it's perfect. All right, now I am going to scrape this off and put it back in here. Look at, I used all of that and I'm going to um, scrape off the extra, put it back in my container. If you have not tried this and you haven't done this at home or if you have a chalkboard, if you would like a chalkboard, if you have a whiteboard at home that you could have fun doing some decorations on it, or you need something, or you need a gift, any of those ideas. Um, I need water, honey. <laughs> Oops, I need water. Hi, Victoria. Uh, you need to try this. That's why I have um, like project nights at my house where you can bring your own board. I have boards to sell at my house, but you can bring your own and uh, use my transfers and my and my chalk and then all right all of you who said the dark what do you think do you like it oh so I just noticed that I want to fix part of that L sometimes I get going fast and I'm not paying attention but it fixed perfectly. With such a large transfer, you can, the, um, the chalk can actually, I'm gonna push that down. Chalk can dry, so I should have probably sprayed it before I did this. But you know what? It's gonna look weathered, and honestly, that's what I was going for. Look at that. I love it. Oh my gosh, it is so cute. Now I'm putting my transfer in a pan of water to kind of let it soak and um, so that that chalk doesn't dry on there. I love it. And I was thinking of adding on a little, oh, like a little string. Hold on. I just have to cut my transfer apart. And we're going to do this in a different color. So it's going to be the lighter brown. Oh my goodness. Okay. So I need to mark the back because this is one of our clear ones. And my permanent marker is here. So I'm just gonna write string on the back, peel it off. Thanks guys, don't you love it? Yeah, I think the dark was a better choice. I'm really happy about that. Uh, when I add this little heart detail, I was thinking of putting it in the lighter color. What do you guys think? Uh, let me just dry for a second this part right here. Awesome. Hmm. There is a, I guess there's a delay. Yeah, there's a delay. Um, so Facebook Live, apparently there's a little delay. I do not want 
the rest of this. All right. So I put my backing over most of it because I just want this little like string. And I'm just going to color part of it. And then I'm going to add that little heart down there. I might even go down that way, down a little bit farther. I cannot. Okay, so I'm going to use one of my small squeegees for this because it's such a, it looks like I'm using chocolate frosting for real. That's so funny. Okay, so pull, whoops, I need to get that top part a little better. Okay, that's a very tiny, tiny, oh, it's meant, you know what, it's meant to do that. So many of our images are kind of like, um, well, obviously, meant to look like chalk as if you were writing with chalk and so they're kind of weathered or um distressed looking a little bit and so that's that's kind of what that was so now my heart which i'm just gonna like outline and then write the word heart so i know which way is which and now i peel this off and stick it on there Hey, Chelsea. Hi, Marcy. Yes, Amy, Amy, yes. Mom painted this. So um, I had told everybody a little bit earlier that um, I think I'm going to let it go off my... I want it straight, though. I'm going to let it go off of the... Um, Oh, look at me. I'm going out of the box. I'm going to let it droop down a little bit. Oh my gosh, you guys, I forgot to let it dry. I wonder if it's going to be messed up. Oh, okay. All right. So I'm going to protect that because I forgot to let it dry. Oh, I can't do that. I am, I am sometimes, I don't think quite right. It's okay. Trial and error, right? All right, I need to push this down and make sure it's secured with the stickiness. Okay, ready to go. Oh, Jake. Oh, my dog. He got behind me. Poor Jake. Okay, so here we go with the heart. I hope this works out. <laughs> you know. If I'm going to make a mistake, I might as well do it on live, Facebook Live, right? Ooh, look at, oh my gosh, I love it. What do you guys think? I love the little heart. I love hearts on things. You know, just a little surprise. Like, who would have thought you would have put a little heart on there? Yeah, Tammy, you like it? I think it's so fun. Oh, look at all my hearts. Thank you, guys. I love it. I love it. I love it. Yes, Amy, it does. The The background totally looks like the ocean. If only I lived by the ocean, except for unfortunately not in the South right now. Pray for all those people. Awesome. So, oh, I used the darker. Heather, I used the darker. Yeah. I, get, I asked what I should do and... Um, then I voted. Oh, I was going to use it for the heart and then I changed my mind in my head, but I probably didn't tell you that because, you know, yes, Chelsea, it's calming. Ooh, maybe I should put it in my classroom. It would totally match. Then I could like, everybody would be calming with my blue lights, Chelsea, my blue lights. So I bought these light covers. Don't tell my husband. Um, I bought these light covers that go over my fluorescent lights and they're like a very calming blue. And anyway, it when you walk in my room, it's totally super calm. Oh, I'm talking with my hands. They're under here. Um, super calm and super um, 
just, I don't know. Yes, I think I'll bring this to school tomorrow, Chelsea, and show everybody, and then I'll put it in my, in my classroom. Oh, Darina, I don't even know if I was, if I was all that. Hey, Karina, I don't know if I was this crafty way back 19 years ago when I had your class in fifth grade. That's so scary. I don't even know. Um, yeah, I'm going to bring it to school. I've already decided. That's so awesome. And it matches my classroom, which is awesome, which is fun. And I have a little, it looks like I got some right here, but, um, the magic of this stuff is that you can wipe it right off. Look at that. Wiped it right off canvas. And, and, uh, that's why anybody can do this. Uh, okay. Awesome. So what I'll do is you guys, I'm going to take this to school tomorrow and then wherever I choose to hang it, I will, um, post a picture. I'll show you guys how it matches. Thank you. Any questions? Who wants to make their own? This is super easy. You know how cheap these are at um, Hobby Lobby or Michael's? Of course, I didn't paint it because you know I don't paint. My mom does. But um, you could find your own. Oh, I found some things. Maybe you'd be interested in this. Uh, these are at Michael or at Hobby Lobby. They're burlap and they're already painted for you. So you could use that. Hi, Betsy. Look at what I made. Hi, Crystal. Yeah, this would be super easy. And then you could do like, well, this is just an eight by 10. 